Hello friends, what's up? Welcome to my YouTube channel where we all learn to make interesting projects with Arduino. Friends, before we start, let me show you the demo of today's project. Friends, this is our RFID based automatic door security system. So friends, this is our RFID sensor This and this is our door knob. Friends, this is our two RFID tags, which we have. So I have currently given access to my this card. So when I put this card near the sensor, this door knob will open. So and our LED started glowing and our door knob has opened. And after 10 seconds, it closes back. Now this card, I have not provided access. So when observe what happens, our red LED gets triggered along with the buzzer, which means that access has not been granted. Friends, to make a RFID based door security system, we require an Arduino Uno, an RFID sensor. I have used MFRC522 RFID sensor, our two RFID tags and two LEDs, two resistors, a breadboard and a buzzer. Friends, this is our RFID sensor. It has eight pins. And friends, with the pack, I have got two RFID tags. As you can see, this is the keychain and this is a proper card. Friends, now we will learn how to give access to these cards using this RFID sensor. Coming to the construction part now. Friends, this is the project which we will do today. This is our RFID sensor. It has eight pins. The 3.3V pin will be connected to pin 3.3 volts on Arduino. The RST pin, also called as reset, will be connected to pin number nine. Friends, GND will be connected to ground. NC or IRQ in some sensors will be connected. No, there is no re connection required. MISO and MOSI pin to pin 12 and 11, respectively. SCK to pin number 13 and SDA to pin number 10. Friends, this was the construction part of the RFID sensor. Servo motor and LED inter interfacing was done in my previous videos. You can refer that. Coming to the code part now. Friends, before we start the code, we need to download a library called MF. RC522. Friends, this is the GitHub link for the library or the link available in the description. So we just need to go on this code part and we need to download the zip. Friends, remember we need to download the zip where we have installed our Arduino software. So I have installed it in documents. So friends, we go in libraries folder and we save it. Friends, as you can see, I have already downloaded it. Now coming to the code part. Friends, before we go with the security system, we need to first determine our RFID ta tag IDs for our these two tags. So I've written a code link in the description. So we will upload this code on our Arduino IDE through the Arduino IDE to our board and we open the serial monitoring system code. Friends, this is our code part. Friends, we have to include this library in our Arduino IDE. You can either download it from the library manager or you can go to the GitHub code present in the link present in the description. And remember to save the, save this, Save this zip library in the same folder where you have saved the Arduino IDE downloading software. Friends, as I showed before, I have used the white color cards ID to grant me access. Friends, now I will show you the output. So for output, we will have to upload this code first. 
oops friends the uploading has been initiated and now i will show you the output friends a message comes put your card to the reader so i i will as you can see our door knob has opened and our green led has been triggered and the message has come that authorized access when the uid tag was this now i will place the wrong tag and observe what happens friends as you can see it has come that access is denied and our red led along with the buzzer gets triggered and when we put the right our door knob opens authorized access comes displayed friends this was today's project using an rfid sensor to make a door security system if you like the video give a thumbs up friends don't forget to subscribe to my channel share this video with your friends thanks for watching stay home stay safe keep learning thank you